Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name is Monica, and today I'm super, super excited to do a full review along with three looks for a palette that has captured my imagination and inspired me so much. This is one of the new palettes from Juvia's Place. This is the Tribe palette. Huh. Just first of all, let's just appreciate this packaging. This is beautiful. This is gorgeous. I love the looks. I love the women. I love the green. And then you open it up and you've got all of the shades right here. Oh my god, look at this. Of course, I picked this up the minute I saw these greens. <laughs> of course, the greens. But we're going to get into all of that and more in this full review video. So before we jump in, don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you love these palette reviews. And if you have it and you'd like to, I hope you will consider subscribing so that you're notified whenever I post a new video every single Monday through Friday. So this eyeshadow palette from Juvia's Place retails for $20 and as I am looking at it today, it is still in stock on their website. You get nine shades in here and it, they said it's limited quantities are still available for ordering. This is, I'm going to go ahead and spoil it. If this is available, get it. I highly recommend this palette and I'll get into exactly why in just a little bit, but it's still currently available on the Juvia's Place website. I purchased it with a discount code, so Angelica Neekfist has a discount code with them which gives you 10% off. I used that, it took $2 off of my order. My shipping was $4.66 and then I had New Jersey taxes, so my total for this palette was $24.16. Completely worth it in my eyes. I really 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 enjoy this palette and I think you get so much product per pan in each one of these eyeshadows like these are huge each one of these pans is like as big as my eye And that's how it is with every single Juvia's Place palette shipping actually didn't take that long for me I got it within a couple of days. It was bubble wrapped to perfection. Nothing happened in transport the color story in this palette is absolute divine perfection. Like if I had thought up my own palette, I would have done basically this exact palette, except I would have probably removed the shade right down here and just put another green in because I love greens. But all of these shades are gorgeous. I love that you've got these mattes up top. They work great for your transition shades. You've got like a lime green, you've got an orange, you've got a forest green, and then this middle row of shimmers. This shimmer right here surprises me so much and you'll see that in the swatches it looks just like a pale kind of pearl shade in the pan but when you swatch it it's got these green undertones and reflex that are gorgeous and they match any green look that you do ah this is my favorite for all over the lid i don't think i did that in one of these looks but i definitely have done it and will continue to do so it's also amazing for your inner corner i'm using it in my inner corner today and it's uh it's it, this uh, oh, i'm getting a little bit too excited but this shade was perfection with the greens in this palette and oh i was just i got so excited also i love this little bronze shade right here in the middle you can use this with the orange you can use this with the greens it really does match well together this deep blue shimmer right over here i have all over my lid today i feel like it it fits in with this color story especially with this last row i basically use this last row for my look today if i were to do something a little bit different i think i would keep this like shimmer to my lower lash line and stick with the green on top but just like look how great that last row looks together ah Okay, just like no matter where you look at this palette, you can just see some great combinations. And I haven't been this inspired by a palette in a long time. It's oh, oh. So now that I'm done kind of gushing about all of these shades, actually, no, I'm not. I want to talk about more about this little matte shade down here. So, this looking in the pan, it looks like a deep blue, but actually, it's a deep, deep green emerald shade and it's perfect for darkening up any green look you might do if you're a fan of green shadows you might know it's hard to find a nice like deep green shadow to deepen up like your outer v it's right here and it's perfect and it's beautiful and just uh, and you couldn't tell from the pan because in the pan it legitimately looks like a deep blue but swatched out and used on your eye, it's just the perfect deep green to pull together your green look. Huh. 
So now, now that I'm actually done gushing about these, let's jump into the swatches. So those are all the swatches. I really hope that that justifies how excited I am about these shades and how they perform. So before I wax poetic more, let's jump into these looks. So I did some like neutral work appropriate looks and then I went all the way to like this deep green kind of look. There's just so much versatility with this palette that excites me a lot. So let's jump into the three looks I created.
you have your swatches, you've got your three looks, you've heard me rant about how much I love these shades and how unique they are. So should you get this palette? I would say yes. It's an affordable palette. It's only $20 plus shipping depending on where you live. Use Angelica Nikvist's code if you would like to save 10%. I'll leave it down. The code is just Angelica. I love this palette. I've bought a lot of palettes since Black Friday and this one has been my favorite. I liked this better than the Melt Smoke Sessions palette. I liked this better than Better. I liked this better than the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Alien palette. I liked this better than any other palette I have recently picked up. These shades are incredibly unique in my collection. I do have about 100 eyeshadow palettes, and this palette stands out and can stand on its own. This is one of the best purchases that I have made recently. I am so glad that I was able to get a hold of this palette. I would highly recommend if you're looking to get out of your comfort zone from neutrals, if you're a green eyeshadow lover, get this palette. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I had a whole lot of fun playing with this palette and putting these looks together and I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you did and I cannot wait to see you in my next video. Bye.